Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a wear test of two foundations that I received from Makeup Forever and Influencer. Um, I did receive these samples to test out and I am super excited about it. Um, I received the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Liquid Foundation uh, and my shade is, uh, I think my shade is 130 in the liquid. Um, and then I also received the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Stick Foundation. And my shade in that one is 127. Um, I have been trying these out separately. Um, I wore this one day all on its own um, for about 16 hours. And holy crap, it lasted all 16 hours. It was fantastic. And then I wore this one um, one day and it, again, it lasted 16 hours. It was amazing. So today I thought I would do a wear test showing you doing check-ins, uh, how it wears all day long. So one half of my face will be done with the liquid and one half will be done with the stick. Um, it is currently 9.48 a.m. So I won't have it on for my usual like 15 to 16 hours, but it will be on for over 12 hours. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started using primers like I always do. I never wear foundation without primer. So I'm just gonna do my usual how I apply foundation and all that good stuff. The first um, primer that I'm gonna use is by Wet n Wild. It is the Cover All Primer. And I actually really, really like this one. Um, I got this for my Wet n Wild full face that I did. I'll link that um, with a card or something up here. But um, I didn't think that I was gonna like this as, as much as I do, but I've been finding myself reaching for it quite a lot. If you wonder why I'm looking over here, I have a mirror over here so I don't have to look in the viewfinder. Uh, then I'm going to, just where I have really big pores, I'm going to use my Smashbox Photo Finish Pore Minimizing Primer. And this is pretty much the combo that I do um, most days when I'm not going to be like, you know, going out and all that good stuff. This is, this is what I do. So I just press that into the places on my face that I have bigger pores. All right, now um, on this side of my face, the left side of my face, I'm gonna be using the liquid and I will be applying with a beauty blender both sides. So the only thing that's gonna be different is the foundation. I love this foundation. I love that it has a pump. Um, it's got amazing coverage. So we're just going to see how they measure up to each other. That's it. And I do like full found, uh, full coverage foundations. So this would definitely qualify as a full cover. So that side is all blended out. Now I'm going to take the stick foundation on the right side of my face. I do have some irritation, red spots, pimples. Um, so we'll see how this covers. a 
a kindergartner when they're trying to blend out foundation or use makeup brushes with their non-dominant hand because I totally do. I'm left-handed so using this in my right hand I feel like I'm super slow and that I can't do it as, as well as with my dominant hand. Oh well. Alright, so I'm just making sure that that both sides are kind of seamlessly, you know. So right off the bat, it looks like the stick gives uh, a more full coverage to it, um, but they both are are pretty full coverage. And my red spots and irritation um, are pretty well covered without having to go in with a concealer. So I'm going to add a tad bit more on the liquid side. Just in areas I feel like it's not as full. And that could just be from the beauty blender, you know, the makeup sponge picking up. Actually, um, and like I said, I'm going to check in a few times throughout the day. So I'm going to go apply the rest of my makeup and I will check back in with you guys in a couple hours. It is now 9.55. Um, and my first check in will probably be around noon. So I will see you guys back here in a little while. Okay, so I'm back. I have applied my full face, um, changed my earrings, did a little something something with my hairs. Um, so yeah, this is the first check-in. It is now 11.10 a.m. So it's been, what, like a little over an hour. Um, yeah. I, both of these foundations wear really, really well. Um, they're both really matte, um, but don't look, you know, super flat or um, drying or cakey. So, yeah, so far I just, I love these foundations. So let's see which one wears better throughout my day. Um, yeah, so if you remember, left side is liquid, right side is stick. Okay, so I will check back in with you guys in a few hours and we'll see how things are still Hey guys, so I'm back for then. my first check-in, or my second check-in, I think. It's now 12.18, so just had lunch, and foundation's holding up really well, as expected. Um, yeah, I don't feel, there's no oiliness, there's no tackiness, um, there's no transfer, it's just Beautiful so I don't really foundation. have much planned for today, just, you know, hanging out inside. My girlfriends are going to be here, we're going to be playing with makeup and all that good stuff. So yeah, I'll check back in in a few hours, probably around 3, 3.30 maybe. So yeah, I'll see hey you guys, guys in my next check in. So I am back for my afternoon checkup um, or check-in. It's 4.30 now. Um, yeah, 4.28. And um, it's, you know, still holding up really well. I don't have any complaints. There's no oils breaking through and there's no, like it doesn't feel oily. It doesn't look oily. There's still no transfer. Um, nothing is, you know, wearing off or wearing down. And yeah, everything still looks really good. So 
I did change my lip color though because all of that had worn off. Let's just say that. Um, so yeah, I will go ahead and check back in with you guys probably around 9.30 or 10, maybe 10.30 before I go to bed, before I wash my face and go to bed. Let's, um, but yeah, I don't know what this is down here. Like my eyes were a little bit watery earlier. So I had a little crust off on the side here of my mascara but anyway yeah the foundation looks amazing still there's no um, like I said no oil no um, it's not really there's a little bit wearing away in the creases of my nose here more so on the liquid foundation side than the stick um, But yeah, I really love these foundations for sure. They hold up really nicely. All right, so I will check back in with you guys in a few hours. So, hey guys, Hi. welcome back. So it is my last check-in of the night for the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Liquid and Stick um, Wear Test. So this morning I applied liquid to this face, to this face, to this side of my face, and stick to this side. Um, that was about mm, 13 hours ago. It is 10, 11 right now. Um, so right off the bat, I'm going to say that I think that the stick performs better um, for long wear. Uh, I feel like it's more flawless over the long run um, and it, they're they're both beautiful and have a beautiful finish and they've lasted a really long time um, but I just feel like they're while they're not neither side is oily um, and there's no transfer again um, I just feel like the stick side performs better for a long period of time. So, with that, I am going to go wash my face, take my contacts out, and go to bed. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. channel. Today I'm going to be doing a wear test, so I will apply... Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a wear test. I recently, recently, I can't even talk already. Holy crap. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a wear test of two foundations. I received... Oh my god.